Hello everyone, today I'll be talking about absenteeism. For some kids, frequent absences can be a long-term habit. Research shows that kids who are allowed to miss school when they are young are more likely to skip school when they are older, and that could lead to other consequences. Being chronically absent affects high school graduation rates and the chances for success in college. In a Rhode Island study, only 11% of high school students with chronic absences made it to their second year of college. That's compared to 51% of students who didn't miss school at all. Kids with learning and attention issues are even more vulnerable to the impact of chronic absences. Plus, when kids miss a few days of school in a row, it can be hard to follow new lessons. And when kids are in school, they are missing, they are missing the opportunities to be identified for intervention and for extra support. It's nearly impossible to avoid all absences and missing a few days during the year shouldn't have a lasting impact on your child's learning and progress. Still, it's easy for those days to add up. That's why it's important to keep track of how many days your child is actually missing. There are also things you could do to help your child want to go to school or at least try or at least not try to avoid it. If your child is struggling and you don't know why, consider having him evaluated. If he has an IEP, make sure all of his supports and services are in place. Thank you for watching.